I decided to make a printer with as many 3D printed parts as possible, so I figured I would start off printing the pulleys. I did not want my idlers to use purchased bearings, so instead I integrated the bearings into the idler, and the results were pretty good. Instead of a deep groove bearing, these idlers use angler contact style bearings, so it can be easily assembled. I'll show you how to assemble it. The required 3D printed parts for this are two roller cages, two shaft halves, one has a hole for a hex screw, and one has a hole for a socket head cab screw, and one pulley. The pulley is designed for a GT2 belt, 6 millimeters wide, and has 20 teeth. You also need 12 standard BBs, 4.5 millimeters in diameter, one nut for an M3 screw, and one socket head cap screw, 30 millimeters long. To assemble it, the first thing you're going to do is take one of the shaft halves and put on the roller cage and then insert six BBs. Then once you got that done, just stick the pulley on top. And then do the same for the next shaft. And then stick the pulley on top of that. And then hold it together with the nut and the screw. So you got that tight, should spin freely. Before I use this, I'll use some Super Lube, which is some PTFE grease, but you could also use lithium, lithium grease as well.